Moving on to another crisis, the coronavirus, which has been rising steeply across the globe. The Delta variant has been driving a surge in cases. Countries are grappling with new infections and growing hospitalizations, with breakthrough infections observed among the vaccinated. On your screens is a map of countries that are dealing with this new, more infectious variant. The United States, which thought that it was in the end game of the pandemic, is dealing with a dangerous surge in infections and hospitalizations. The United Kingdom has also witnessed a new surge in cases. In West Asia, Iran and Israel are both dealing with the rise in infections as the countries race to inoculate their population. In South Asia, Sri Lanka has announced a 10-day lockdown to curb the spread. In Southeast Asia, it has followed the same path with Vietnam locking down its cities. Indonesia, which had imposed restrictions, is now easing its COVID-19 curbs as cases drop from the peak. Japan, too, is dealing with the surge in cases as the Tokyo Paralympics open in the country. And as countries race to inoculate their population against the Delta variant, a South Korean study has found that people infected with the Delta variant have a viral load 300 times higher than those with the original version of the coronavirus. Now, higher viral load means that the virus spreads far more easily from person to person, this increasing infections and hospitalizations across the globe. Epidemiological research also suggests that the Delta variant is at least 40% more transmissible than the Alpha variant. Studies have suggested that fully vaccinated individuals remain vulnerable with the breakthrough infections becoming more and more common. Earlier, the WHO had said that it is the most transmissible variant so far. Delta is the most transmissible of the variants identified so far. Has been identified in at least 85 countries and is spreading rapidly among unvaccinated populations. A recent research suggests that a key amino acid mutation may be behind the ferocious ineffectivity of the Delta variant. While scientists say that the Delta variant has several key mutations, it is unlikely to be the only reason fueling its rapid transmission. Low vaccination rates are also responsible for this surge. The virus, the Delta variant itself, is really circulating in areas of low level of vaccine coverage. Um, and in the context of very limited and inconsistent use of public health and social measures. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.